Hello and a very warm welcome to a special World Talks. My name is Sasha Farbach. And I'm Alex. And let's begin with a very unique episode here. It's time for a bit of culture as we delve into a very unique combination of music and rhythm with our next guest who never miss a beat. That's right. And joining us are Adam Swig, CEO of Value Culture and Kosha Deals hip hop artists. And then the studio right now. Hello, welcome, guys. What's going on? Hey, guys, thanks for having us. Pleasure you made it here. Now, I want to know all about this. How did this all begin? This oyve is something that we know of a little bit, but uh, solve, that's something I, I don't know. So tell us how this all came about, Adam. Oh, solve. Well, that's a great program that Kosha and I started a few years ago uh, when we saw some anti Semitism uh, in the African American community in America, and uh, we want to do something about it. You know, we, we don't believe in sitting still. We want to speak out when something's going wrong. And we created a, a program, a collaboration between the two communities to explore music, arts, and culture because that's what truly heals us. Mm -hmm. yeah. So now, and what brings you guys to Warsaw? Oh, Warsaw. We are in uh, Poland because two reasons. Uh, I'm filming a documentary series with uh, legendary film director Tony K. Most people know him from American History X. And we're here for the Krakow Jewish Culture Festival. Uh, which celebrates uh, Jewish culture in Poland and from around the world. Nice. Now, Kosha uh, deals, like, I mean, that name is unique. You're an artist. Yeah. So I know also you've come here from another performance, rushing here to get to us. Yeah. So, like, I mean, tell us about this this rhythm, this inspiration, you know, where, where does it all come from for you? Um, you know, um, just, you know, similar to Adam, just like the Solve idea, just coming and bringing up my Jewish roots. My family actually have Jewish roots in Warsaw and uh, we're Israeli. And I just kind of combined my like Jewish mysticism and uh, culture with uh, hip hop, which is black culture. I'm on a television show called Wild and Out. It's the longest running black television show in the U.S. 20 seasons right now. It comes out next week, uh, the 20th season. I'm the Jewish representative. I think a soul vey is like, you know, soul food and oy vey. We bring the Yiddish uh, to that and just sort of bridging our communities together, shared, shared legacy, shared struggle. And that's what we do anyway. Me and Adam have been doing this. This is, would be our regular lives if it was a program or it wasn't a program. But just with the Jewish Culture Festival, I think it's a one place in Poland that really captivates the love of Jewish culture and that we get to kind of expose them to hip hop, klezmer, and I'm someone who doesn't necessarily like meshes all that together ironically with or without these festivals existing so it's sort of like a perfect home for us mm -hmm. of us uh, to speak and perform at mm -hmm. so uh, now what has been sorry to interrupt so what has what has been the response of people to what you guys are doing i i say i mean it's been successful outside of Poland. Over here, I mean, we even had a performance in the street last night. Oh. I think there's like a special uniqueness to the love of and excitement in Krakow and, and you know, just in Warsaw, but specifically in Krakow, it was, it's a really exciting vibe. So, you know, so far so good. So far so good. <laughs> and I think also it comes at such an important time, doesn't it? I mean, a lot of things, when we look at the Holocaust, look at the terrible tragedy in history, um, I mean, it's important to remember, but I think the spin you're taking on, you're taking that, that whole memory, but also putting on a very positive, you said healing nature to all this, mm -hmm. right? I mean, tell us a bit more about why this is so important right now in our world. Well, yeah, you know, this all started with my grandmother. She's an amazing person in our family, does have Polish roots. Uh, and she always taught me to repair the world, you know, if I could repair the world. And that's why I started this nonprofit value culture. That's our mission repair the world through arts, culture, and philanthropy, engage people, and do it in a fun way. Mm. And that's what Kosha Dills and I do best. We, we, make, we make it fun and uh, with <laughs> these programs. And, you know, we want to have fun with you guys today, too. Yeah, yeah. Well, I, on the fun, I think, Alex, we were talking a little bit earlier with you guys. There is, I don't know if we can do this, uh, a little bit of maybe, Kosha Dills, a little bit of a freestyle that you can share with us. Is that possible? Yeah. Actually? So, so what, sh what are some things I should shout out, like, in the freestyle? Well, I don't know, Alex, what do you think? Maybe. Sasha and Alex, I got to give you guys a shout out, so that's one. <laughs> okay, right. great. Uh, Wars Warsaw, maybe. Warsaw. Yeah. Uh, what else? Uh, maybe Krakow or... Um... Okay, Krakow, obviously Valley Culture and this awesome pickle shirt. That, <laughs> thanks for wearing my merchandise and advertising <laughs> to the stuff, world. Yeah. <laughs> and any other special things we should get in there? I think summer. I want, I want to hear about the summer. Definitely. Well. Okay, yeah, yeah and I'll, and I'll talk about some of my programs. Um, okay, cool. All right. So let's, uh, I'm going gonna, I'm gonna to wrap over No B. We call it acapella, but uh, some of us call it Acapulco. <laughs> <laughs> All right. Um, 
kosher deals on TVT to world views, especially for Sasha and Alex delivering world news. You know my value kosher, plus I value culture. Deals on a never praying for death like vultures. All right, down for the buster. I asked my mother. She said, you out in Warsaw, better enjoy that summer. You know the flow. Believe it and it so well. Even an expensive time to stay at cheap hotels. All right, so you never want to go and pass out for having too much fun. When you're hanging in crack out, a lot of people say they doubt it, even if I'm clouded, I'm on Wilder now, and had to take a trip to Auschwitz to do a documentary. It's kosher great, especially American History X with Tony K. I got lonely greats when I'm rocking these flows. I stay schmoozing like Yiddish at my comedy shows. I got a lot of things doing it A-OK. -okay. We did Monticello, Shabbat Rock, and Solvay, especially for the rhyme is true. And did you tell him about the Asian-Jewish collaboration, Soyvey, that's Jewish-Chinese food? So this is nice when I hang out with Alex and Sasha, you guys are my homies, and after this, we should all go get pierogies. You know what I'm saying? Oh, you know right. what I mean? Woo! Let's get some pierogies, right? Drop. There you go. <laughs> that was go. awesome. Who makes better pierogies? Which one of you? Oh, that would be no question. That's on all the side. <laughs> let's, of, of yeah, the let's table. say. <laughs> okay, yeah. Lots of balls and pierogies. <laughs> Absolutely. Culinary thing is interesting. Also, there is some artwork that you've also brought. We've done, had this musical thing, but also mm -hmm. the impressions I think you got. I want to share this, I think, right. with our audience. It's a little uh, intense. This is your, it's intense. <laughs> it's intense, but I think your impressions of Auschwitz. So I'm going to just show well, this to our this viewers. Tony, Tony, okay, Tony. Okay, we got we to preface this. We got to, this we got to preface so it. Viewers. We got to preface yeah. it that it is um, Tony Kay's. This is the work of Tony Kay. He is a master, okay, you guys. You've seen his work your whole lives. He did music videos, Grammy Award winning music videos for mm. Johnny Cash for Red Hot Chili Peppers. And he's an artist, a director. Uh, we were in Auschwitz yesterday. It mm. was a, a heavy day, our first trip there. And Tony saw this sign. He saw a guitar with a, a cross. And it just, we said, you know, that's a place with no culture. That's what we want to repair. We want to bring culture. We want to repair Jewish, the Jewish culture in Poland as well. Mm. That's what we're doing at the Krakow Jewish Culture Festival. And uh, Tony just, that's, he, he performed two nights ago and it was just really special. I think there's also this, this next one here I want to show our viewers as well. So yeah, and, at the men's chat. Here. Yeah, this is Tony's interpretation of, of us. That's, you know, we went to uh, Auschwitz yesterday. That's me in the men's hat yesterday. Right over here, yeah. Uh-huh, and there's Tony in the, in the, in the other hat. And it's our, our hope is not a dream tour. That's what we want to remind people. Hope is not a dream. Stay positive, mm. right? Things get better. And we work together. Anything is achievable. That's what me and Kosha both believe in. We work really hard together and uh, with so many great artists and people. And we're, achie we're achieving. We're here right now. We're with you. So yeah. don't give up. That's the message we want to give everybody. I think um, we should, you know, that Tony, if just for those who don't know, I mean, it, I just watched a film before coming over, before we get to work with them. I mean, it's Edward Norton, Edward Furlong. Mm. I mean, just kind of like iconic moments in, in cinema history right before the streaming era. But American History X sort of set the tone for all stuff of films that kind of exposed like homegrown white supremacy in America. Um, it was a really moving film with some of the best actors. But we now also work with Sammy Stagman, a Holocaust survivor in Harlem. We bring him all over. Um, he comes to our shows, performances. Um, but we also brought him on the audio app Clubhouse during the pandemic. We brought a Holocaust survivor to speak to over 50,000 people. Um, and finally, you know, a Holocaust survivor speaking to non-Jewish people, which is really hard because, you know, most, play most people aren't going to come mm. here. I come here because my whole family died here. So it does for me and you know and also Adam's family and a lot of other people but for, for that this is what we're just trying to do like groundbreaking ways to bring people to culture to, to expose them to things that they never would have gotten because we get to operate in different spheres you know music comedy film mm -hmm. um, Jewish black Asian community just because we're members you know we're like outstanding members of social communities we mm -hmm. like to go out we, we, these are all our friends this is something that like drives us so um, and it yes. brings it brings peace. Yeah, it brings peace to the world. It's also, I think, like um, it sounds almost like it's a new genre by itself, as you said, not just the right. musical, but I think in, in performance and, and everything you've just mentioned, it sounds like a totally new uh, energy of something. Um, it's never been every done day. Before. Yeah, every day we're like, let's just come up with another good idea. <laughs> See, like, and if it sounds crazy, I mean, when, when we did mozzarella, it was just like, let's bring Passover to Coachella. Mm -hmm. When you know, and people were like, "There's hundred thousand people. It's the world's most famous festival. Let's bring these things to, yeah. to places that people never had it." And that's sort of, if it's never been done, we'll probably try it out. We're, we're not afraid to try new things, and yeah. neither should anybody. You got to keep pushing. You got to try new things, and if you work hard, it'll, it's going to work out. Amazing stuff. So as we conclude now, let's get just 
one word your impressions of Poland. What do you think of Poland right now? Just we'll start with you, Adam. Oh man, I like the people. People. I like the architecture. Architecture. Of, uh, yeah, I'm really like a big fan of just the aesthetic of Krakow and Warsaw and just, you know, the kind of history of it and the buildings and stuff because it just, you know, brings me closer to like where my grandparents sort of walked and I know I'm, I'm, a, I'm a fan of that and just trying to learn my own history. Yeah, I thought you were going to say pierogi, you know. <laughs> well, you know, I already gave pierogies a shout out. We can't give, I don't want to give shout outs to too many carbs on the All show. Right. Yeah, yeah, yeah. You guys do have a vibe here for sure. <laughs> <laughs> so now if someone wants to see you while you're still in Poland, where can they do that? Alchemia, I guess, if you want to see us perform. Um, we've been there with uh, a great uh, klezmer artist named So-Called, Joshua Dolgan, um, every night in Frank London for the jams from the Klezmatics. So that's for the next, uh, you know, tonight and tomorrow. And uh, other than that, I guess you could just, you know, DM yeah. Adam. I value culture on shout Instagram. Out, and shout out to Janusz at the Jewish Culture yeah. Festival for having us. Great stuff. And Jonathan from uh, the JCC Krakow. Wonderful. Well, Great. thanks, guys, for coming. I think it was also that historic performance we've ever had. That <laughs> right. Well, well listen, that was a first. And if a you ever need first. someone to history. rap during news, <laughs> yeah. That's what we're trying to do. We're trying yeah. to make history. And... Uh, Somewhere in Wikipedia, they'll be like, yeah. there was two people that rapped yeah. on television. This is it. Well, this, this I got, was I got a quick right. question. Do you guys value culture? That's what I need to know. Absolutely. Yeah. That's right. You're, you're here right now. That's, that's what we do. <laughs> that's yeah. what I like to hear, guys. Yeah, thank you, you guys. so much. Thank you so thank much. Thank you both for joining Adam Swig, us. Adam Swig, Kosher Deals, thank you so much for all that. Really appreciate it. Thank you. I love these swinging seats. I'm going to swing around. <laughs> and we conclude uh, this rhythmic uh, session of our interviews. Thank you so much, but stay tuned right here on TVP World. As there's much more coming up.